Woo! Beach rising there now. Hey everybody, welcome back to Monster Heat, and today we're dehydrating some hot sauce. <laughs> Let's do it. You know, I brought along some of my personal favorites. So look at this colorful sauce, Ethereal from Hurtberry Farms. And then I also brought, this is a fiery hot sauce, guys, Cherry Noble from Sorry Sauce. We got two from Purple Tongue. We got Blueberry, and then we got Nashville North. And then from Heiko's Hot Sauce, I brought along Mustard Menace. All great sauces, very colorful, all Canadian too. And then I thought, you know what, let's have some fun. What about trying to dehydrate some tank? <laughs> Will it dehydrate? Probably not. Will it all evaporate? Maybe. But stick around to the end to find out. And speaking of the end, I thought, what the heck? Let's dehydrate a little bit of extract. The end hot sauce from Pepper Palace. This is 6 million Scoville, guys. Let's dehydrate it. Maybe it'll turn into like a little lozenge candy. <laughs> what the heck? Let's try it. Let's see what happens. Stick around to the end and find out. <sighs> so I thought, what the heck, you know, I got so many unopened sauces in my fridge. Let's just add to the collection and open more sauces and dehydrate some and have some fun. Oh, hey, everybody. You know what? I plan on opening more bottles of hot sauce to add to you guys already in the fridge. But uh, I promise next time out or next challenge, I'll use some of you guys, okay? All right? All right, I promise, okay? So my dehydrator, guys, I got it already preloaded. I'm gonna show you what we got on the go here. Each layer is already got parchment paper on it. Each layer is parchment paper. We got three layers we're gonna do here. I also got the centers cut out to allow airflow up through the dehydrator and I will say also, you know, I was sitting home, sitting home the other day, alone in my thoughts. Not like that. <laughs> but, you know, and I got to thinking, you know, you know, usually when I come, I, I get an idea and I try, I run with it. I get thinking about it. First thing I do, I go on YouTube, I'm checking and sure enough, somebody has done this already. I don't think they've done the tincture or the extract yet. So I thought, why not? Let's give it a go. Let's see what happens. Could be a fun little experiment. And uh, so let's do it. We're gonna lay out all the hot sauces right now. Okay, first up is Ethereal. Let's add her patties. And this is just like bacon cookies. Bruh. Next, we'll throw a few drops of mustard menace around in there. We'll have a beautiful layer. I'm just going to go right here with one. Kind of smear it out a bit. Kind of smooth it out a bit. And I kind of think you do want a little thicker. So it has a little more texture to it. You don't want to go too thin, but you don't want to go too thick either. I think you just got to find the right uh, kind of thickness there. We'll figure it out though, guys. It's all an experiment here, right? <laughs> we'll see. Maybe it won't work. Next layer, we'll go with Blueberry from Purple Tongue. Another great sauce, fiery hot. This is made with Carolina Reaper and Boo Joklia Ghost Pepper. We'll go Purple Tongue again. We'll go Nashville North, bye. This is a great sauce. One of my favorites ever in a hot sauce. I, put, I could use it on almost everything, guys. This bottle's almost gone. <laughs> this bottle is gone. <laughs> there you have it. Look, empty bottle, but she's empty. Great sauce, if you can get your hands on that, get some. We're gonna add the end extract. And this is kind of more like a, a molasses consistency. But we're just gonna add a bit, maybe one, maybe two over here. There we go. 
I gotta save some of this. Kim, I know this is supposed to be for the 2000 video and I am gonna be using it for that. So bear with me. <laughs> I gotta get my tolerance back up. <laughs> now for the last layer, guys, we're just gonna add some sorry sauce. Cherry Noble. I love this sauce, another great sauce. You know, it's it's such a great sauce, you know. I had it on cheesecake before, but then I went to put it on cheesecake, chicken. I had it on my salad. <laughs> and it's got amazing heat to it, guys. Very, very hot. Let's cover up these blobs right here, bud. With the tank, okay, maybe it absorbs into the paper. I'm not 100% what's gonna happen here. It shouldn't though. Okay, it's gonna run down into the Cherry Noble is what it's gonna do. Anyway, something like that. We got it over here pulled up. Should dehydrate. Can I get it anywhere else, maybe? I'm thinking this could turn into like a little candy lozenge okay so there we have it guys and look at how good that sauce is laying down that's laying down better than your never mind <laughs> so what we're gonna do we are gonna set this to 135 degrees we're gonna let it run for as long as it takes to solidify and then Hopefully we get good airflow through the whole dehydrator and I'll check back and I'll let you guys know how we're making out as soon as it's done. I'm excited. Hopefully I can bring some to work to everybody and give them some hot cherry noble dehydrated hot sauce. <laughs> Ready for hours later. Okay guys, our dehydrated hot sauce is done. It roughly took a couple of hours. I think after the first like three hours, it was almost done. And I let it run for 24 hours total. So one other thing, I was gonna bring this into work, but you know what? Screw them guys. <laughs> I'm just kidding guys, I love you, but you aren't getting any. What we're gonna do, we're gonna do a challenge. I'm gonna eat it all. And I'm gonna see how long it takes me right now. <laughs> one other thing you could do with this guys, you know, if you wanted to, you could dehydrate the hot sauce and then you could also grind it up into a powder and put it into a shaker and put it on all your meals, right? Let's get into it and see how good this is, man. So there we go. There's our first layer, remember? Check that out. Hope you guys can see that good. Now this here is Mustard Menace from Heiko's Hot Sauce. Mmm, very good. Sounds like you're eating potato chips. <laughs> One layer done, guys. Wow. This one is like a chip. It <laughs> sounds like it. A chip of Hurtberry? Yeah, this is Etherol from Hurtberry. Very good. You could crumble it up and put it on top of salad. Or... Yeah. This is Blueberry from Purple Tongue Hot Sauce. Mm. This here will be Nashville North. This here Tastes awful. <coughs> I don't know where the other piece went though. Oh, there it is. The other piece at the end. Did the tank do anything? It's on your lip. That tastes awful. That's done. This here, Cherry Noble. Beach rising there now. 
I think with the end and the nail of this. Yeah, the tincture guys did solidify a bit. Like there's the tank. Like it looks like. You can't even see. No, it looks just like a piece of glass. Yeah. Make sure none's going on the carpet there in front. I think the beach went cook. Oh, there it is. I gotta say, I may be doing this again. Nose is starting to run a bit. Would you prefer chugging hot sauce or eating it? <laughs> well, I might do it again and make a powder. Put it all into a shaker. Whoo! My heat is probably five. I think I'm eating paper a bit here. It's not coming off very good, this one. What is it? It's very noble. Which is your favorite dehydrated sauce? Uh, I think they're all pretty good. What I'd like to do is make a mixture. Have a mixture of uh, all the Canadian ones together and, and put it all into a shaker. We call it, what, Old Canada? <laughs> yeah, that's, that's good. That's good. <laughs> all right, guys. There you have it. We ate all the dehydrated hot sauce. Six minutes. Six minutes. Oh, Not bad. Nice. Uh, yeah, that was pretty good, guys. If you take on that, if you take it on and dehydrate anything like hot sauce or whatever, let me know or tag me so I can see the video. I'd love to see different people's takes on what they might use or I wish I had done this sooner uh, I think there's a wide open world we can do like making powders and then if you wanted to you know you could grind it up into a powder and once it's in that state you could add water or vinegar again and turn it back into hot sauce I'm gonna go guys burn it pretty good here uh, that's gonna do it for me Bammy. Cheers, everybody. Ooh, baby. Uh, oh, wow.